everybody, Dom here. I occasionally play casual mode to grid keep in Team Fortress 2, and recently I noticed something. No matter what map option appeared at the end of the rounds, people would always vote to continue playing to grid keep, and every time, it would win as the next map the server would play. Because of this, servers seem to persistently continue to play the map over and over. It got to the point where I jokingly say at the map vote screen that no matter what, the grid keep will always win. And sure enough, it always did. It seems the grid keep always wins. This is just a hypothesis based on quick and dirty observation. I have to know for sure. I have to know in a more statistical way if the group keep will always win map votes when it's the current map in casual mode. And if not, what is the likelihood that it will win? So I decided to whip out a spreadsheet and get some data. Here it is, linked to the data available alongside the video. I played and observed 100 rounds of casual mode to group keep and marked down the map vote results for each. I abstained from each map vote and did as little as possible to influence the voting outcome. Basically, I didn't say or do anything and just let map votes happen how they would naturally. In 100 games, the group keep won the map vote to continue being played 100% of the time. The only exception to this was one occasion where there was a small player count and every single player left the server at the map vote screen. No one voted, so each map option was zero votes, yet the group keep still won, funnily enough. One observation I made while collecting data is that on higher player count servers, there was a better chance people would spread out their votes and vote for the other two options. Overall, the group keep averaged getting a vote of 91.68%. The other options combined averaged 3.6%. The highest vote a non group keep map option got was 29%. Lastly, 43% of the time, the group keep got all of the map votes. Now, this data isn't perfect. 100 games isn't a big sample size when considering how popular the map is and how often it's played in a day. But what's for sure is it isn't just some sort of fluke that Degroot Keep seems to win all its map votes. The takeaway here is, it statistically has a higher chance of winning map votes. Anyways, that's about it. Next time you play casual mode Degroot Keep and see the map vote appear on screen, know that there's a high likelihood that regardless of map options, the server will probably continue playing Degroot Keep. Thanks for watching. Au revoir.